Hi there, it's George Guy Clocks. Uh, this is my Mossberg 590A1. If you haven't got one, get one. <laughs> um, this, this is the 590A1. This is what you call it a six shot. This ain't the uh, nine eight, was an eight or nine shot they got out. Um, I bought this used. It's like brand new. Whoever had this never shot this sucker. It's more like a dust collector, I think it was. Um, it's got the uh, peep eye sight on it. Um, the five, the five nineties, a ones, and the regular five hundreds. The difference in them is the trigger guard's metal and they Palmer for one. Um, The barrel here is more thicker than a regular 500. Um, this is unloaded. Um, there's different there's different ways you can get this gun, all kind of different ways. But um, this one here, it's got the uh, extra shells in the suspended stock folds. I had four shells in it, two on each side, so you carry four extra shells in it. For that um this is this is a pump pump shotgun um i for uh i think i paid shit if i'm not for mistaken i think i paid damn 290 for or something like that use i got this in my ruger at the same time my, my boat God, I put them on layaway. That's how I get most of my guns. I ain't, I ain't a millionaire. So I, when I get a gun, I got a layaway on it. Just like everybody else. Most most of the people. How do you do it? That's what, how I got to do it. Um, uh, military, they use this gun a lot. The police, a lot of police use this type of gun. Um, this past military specs. Um, I do have a Ruger. I mean, a I do have a Remington 870, and I, I say this gun and the Remington, they're pretty much at the same level of, of quality-wise and shotguns. I mean, a lot of people don't like the aluminum um, frame here, and the Remington's got the s steel. I mean, it's, it's preference. It's all preference for what you want in the shotgun. But they mostly both reliable, pretty much reliable. I mean, I love a pump shotgun. And uh, Mossberg, they make that um, auto too. I forget the, the numbers to that. I don't know if it's, shit, I forget the, what it's called offhand. Um, Pete from the Armor Channel, channel he's got the, the Mossberg with the, the auto. But I forget the model number on that offhand. Um... I mean, you can't go wrong. If you got either one of them, the Mossberg or the uh, Remington, you can't go wrong with them. I mean, this is the this is the six shot. It's five in the chamber, one in five in the two, one in the chamber. These six shots. I had to get it. I mean, it was a good deal. So I said, "What the hell?" My, I took my friend down to the gun shop. He was looking for a shotgun to get, and um. He had this in the used part. I said, man, here. I, I gave it to my friend. I said, here, check this gun out. You know? And, um, I think he was just one so window shop bullshit. I think, man, I said, man, I think so nice. Looks so new looking. I said, I said, hell, if he ain't going to get it, I'll get it. And so I bought it. And if you're looking for a home defense and you don't got that much money, and you don't want a pistol, you don't want to put money in a pistol and go through all the, the uh, you still got to do paperwork on this, but you, you get this in the same day. You don't have to, you make a phone call, depends what state you live in, but my state, you just make a phone, they make a phone call, and about five or ten minutes, they let you know if you got it for a shotgun. And 
you can get this the same day, walk out with it. I mean, if you look for home defense, this a shotgun is the way to go. Like I said in my last video, if I only had one gun to have, it would definitely be a 12 gauge. It's, you could use it in so many different ways. Um, if you're in a home robbery, just by just doing this, just that sound right there alone, people know to say, get the fuck out of here, just from doing that. Um, the safety's right here. That's, if you see a red dot, it's ready to fire. And that's safety on it. This gun's been safety checked, so it ain't loaded. Um, I say this, you're going to get a shotgun, uh, I'll spend a few extra dollars to get the 590 instead of the 500. I mean, it's only a couple dollars more. Well, if you got a new one, you're probably talking about probably $100, $200 more maybe. Um, I, I got this gun not that long ago. Probably been a few months. I haven't been doing videos. I just got bored tonight. I, I can start putting more videos out. But you, I mean, you got to set everything up, and it's kind of a bullshit hassle all the time. But like Pete from the Army Channel, he he got that basement it's already set up and go. I guess it's so easy for him now to make videos. But for me, I got to put shit together and, and stuff, and I've got nobody on new camera, so that's kind of hard too. When you do a video like this, and you're trying to do one by yourself, it's kind of a pain in the ass. But this gun is a nice shotgun. I had to get it. I read for, for what they're asking for it, and it looks brand new. Hell yeah. Shit, if I had to carry, if I had two, a choice of this, uh, this is the one I would probably carry. I mean, I got, I got that Spaz 12, but you're, you're talking about a heavy ass shotgun. That's a heavy ass shotgun if you're going to log out around all day. This here, perfect. That or the Remington uh, 870. The perfect shotgun for me to carry around all day. That's all I would need is a pump. I don't, I don't need no auto. Really, I don't. Just when I got that Spaz 12, I got that on a trade and. Um, I got a good deal when I couldn't pass it up. That's kind of like money in the bank, really. That shotgun. But I just I just like a regular pump shotgun. Like a Mossberg or a Remington 8 center probably my best shotguns to have. Um, and that's it for this video, and Happy New Year to all, all. and I'll see you.